Hi my loves, welcome back. Um, today I'm going to be doing a very exciting Christmas party look for you. This is partly in collaboration with Bare Minerals. You guys know I love them. I've got some fun Christmas gift sets which I'm going to be um, using products from today which is so exciting. Also I'm really sorry for this bubbling noise you can hear. I don't know how much you're going to be able to hear it. I'm hoping that the microphone is going to help me out but the radiators, the heating system, in this house has just been bubbling like this for like five days and I need to film today so I apologize for that hopefully it's not too annoying but anyway I'm gonna get started I'm gonna start with my fave with the Bare Minerals original foundation popping that everywhere I have finally conceded that my skin is lighter than it was in summertime it took me long enough so I'm using a lighter color today and I'm just gonna pop that everywhere um, I've been saying to everyone that I've been seeing recently that if there's one thing that's kind of sad about being self-employed is that you don't have an office Christmas party and I know that some of you guys are probably like groaning at that I mean like there's nothing special about the office Christmas party but I just feel like I'm missing out on something so for me this Christmas party look is you know for family and friends party but could be your office Christmas party look. I don't know, I think it's something about like having one in the work environment so that like you're kind of letting off steam in a worky kind of way. Because obviously I do lots of Christmas celebrations with my family and my friends. So I'm not missing out on that front. But yeah, I think it would be nice to have like a worky one. I even think this colour might be still a little bit too dark for me, but I'm not going lighter. Also, I'm always having to match my pink pink face to my yellow yellow body which is always quite the task but anyway you guys i want to hear your christmas party stories down below okay i love hearing about them right i'm going to use the bare minerals bare skin concealer um just on some blemishes Doo -doo. i don't usually put my concealer straight on from the wand but this is a nice fresh concealer so i'm treating myself <laughs> today I would usually put it on the back of my hand and then go from there. I love this concealer because it just feels so light but does a really nice job of concealing. <laughs> Thank goodness. Right, so I'm kind of going to let my concealer settle into my skin. This is quite a wet consistency so I usually just let it settle before I start blending anything else on top. I'm going to prime quickly with my favourite um, Gen Nude Eyeshadow and Primer in Basic which is a kind of dark-ish colour. I prime with this most days just because I like to have a little bit of colour actually on the lid in my primer. It just gets things going a lot quicker and I love a quick makeup. Then I'm just going to cover the lid in a kind of slightly pinky rosy shade. Pinks are my absolute favourite at the moment and you'll see from the Bare Minerals packaging that it's very much their vibe as well. And now for the fun bit. I have these Bare Minerals Metal Eyes Gen Nude Metallic Eye Trio Limited Edition. I have not seen these before. This is one of their gift sets for Christmas. And it is so exciting. Um, there's three shades. We've got Citrine, which is an opalescent champagne, Sunstone, which is a rose gold, and Pink Opal, which is a rose taupe. So I am going to use the rose gold. I think that much was obvious immediately. Um, so yes, so it comes like this. And a little doe foot applicator. And I'm just going to pop that on top. And what I love about these is that they're not too wet. So you can kind of actually have a fair amount of control as to where you put them compared to other products which are similar and they kind of give an almost like wet effect it's so pretty i'm just gonna zoom you guys in a bit so you can see oh love it um what i might do as well actually is i'm gonna take i'm gonna take citrine as well and just maybe pop that on the inner corners just to add a little extra and then we have a liner this is the bare minerals lash domination ink liner i've never tried this so this is going to be a first impressions I 
I actually really like that. It's quite a kind of short-ish nib, as you can see. I don't know what it is, but it's very, I think it's a felt tip um, applicator, but it's quite a kind of um, inky formula for a felt tip applicator. And also the packaging feels really nice and heavy, which is sometimes quite nice when you're doing eyeliner because it gives you a bit more control. And because it's a Christmas party look, we need to do something a little bit more fun. I'm going to do little dots underneath my eyes just to make them a little bit look a little bit bigger. Just in the centre to kind of soften it a little bit as well. I'm going to take a kind of dark brown uh, shadow and just go and blend on that top line a tiny bit. Just to soften it a little tiny bit. Time for mascara. You can add lashes as well if you want to be a bit extra. I'm gonna do my brows quickly. Get them all into place. I'm loving this eyeshadow. I just think it's like really subtly pretty right i'm just waiting for my brows to dry so i'm gonna do some more complexion stuff and we have another gift set from bare minerals i know i'm being really annoying because i'm using like multiple sets today um but i am now going to use the get glowing set which has the dew mist setting spray the bronzer and the highlighter so i am gonna do a little bit of bronzing very important part of my routine i love these little minis as well i'm just like obsessed they look so cute and small i always forget to do my bronzer before i do my brows because then i'm going around my brow like trying desperately not to <laughs> mess it up and continuing to be annoying i'm using an exclusive palette for the festive season i've actually lost the sleeve for this um but it comes in a little set with what else does it come with so it also comes with a mineral veil um, a Lash Topia Mascara and a little Skin Longevity Vital Power Infusion uh, sample which I love that stuff, so nice for priming. So anyway, this is the palette and I am going to use one of the blushes from it because they looked so pretty when I had a little look before. I love these blushes. So I'm going to use I think the lighter one. Oh yes, I love that. I love giving um, Bare Minerals those presents as well because people just end up loving it and they didn't know they would love it so much. And I'm always like, yep, it's just that good, you guys. Back to my Get Glowing um, set. I'm gonna use the little baby highlighter, how gorgeous. And I'm just gonna pop that on the tops of my cheekbones. All the good stuff, you know where it goes. It's Christmas, so you've got to ramp up the highlighter, I think. Got to do a kind of Rihanna style, take it onto the temples thing. I can't remember where I learned that. It was from that video um, where her makeup artist, I think it's, is she doing Nikki Shorrells' makeup? And I was like, yes i love that i want to take my highlighter onto my temples always right i'm going to finish off the brow okay gotta do my trusty freckles just because i think they kind of add a little kind of undoneness to a makeup look that actually makes it prettier especially with these kind of pink vibes i honestly just love that kind of combination i watched um, Klaus last night on Netflix and oh my goodness you guys it is the cutest thing I've ever seen I was crying it's a little animated film and yeah Netflix got it bought the rights to it made it whatever and it is so cute I love when you find a good new Christmas film because I love my Christmas films I love to watch, watch them rewatch them every year but it is nice to just like find a new one occasionally. I actually quite like a lot of relatively new Christmas films. Like I like um, Arthur Christmas, another good one. And I like that one, the Scrooge one. 
um, they did with Jim Carrey um, from the Polar Express people, I think. It's not very popular, but I kind of love that. Okay, I'm gonna use my mineral veil and just powder down some of the super shiny areas. Okay, finally, my loves. Um, I have this super cute gift set, which has got three lipsticks in it of my favorite, favorite lipstick. These are the Bare Minerals Longwear lipsticks. Um, I'm gonna use Petal today. I usually use Peony. I'm going to use Petal, which is going to line first with Pillow Talk. They're quite similar colours, actually. And that is me done, you guys. I am loving this look. It's relatively simple and easy, right? It's not, it's not like so many eye products or anything like that, but I think it's really effective. So I hope you guys enjoyed a um, little bit of glitz and glimmer and highlight and glowiness. Oh, I forgot to do my dewy mist. Let's do that. Just to add a bit of extra glow because you know, it's Christmas. And that should also fix my makeup in place as well. But anyway, right now I'm gonna show you my outfit. And this guys, is my ultimate Christmas outfit, Christmas party outfit. You just can't have too much, can you? I'm wearing these amazing Cezanne trousers that I showed you the other day with some silver heels from River Island from very last year. I'm sure they'll do something similar this year. My favourite coat that I got from the Buffalo Exchange. Um, it's kind of golden red, so I thought it would be a perfect Christmas edition and then this silk this is a vintage silk Giorgio Armani shirt I'm just yeah loving it now I really desperately want to go to a Christmas party but I am not today maybe some point this this month but not today but this is me right my loves I'm gonna go thank you so much for watching today hope you enjoyed oh my god I really don't want to take this outfit off but anyway hope you enjoyed thank you for watching and I'll see you again very soon bye